hello guys welcome back to the channel crypto global hundred and uh, yesterday i posted on my youtube uh community tab that which coin should i predict uh let me know in the comments and one of our subscriber uh he mentioned that ship coin uh to be predicted and i'm waiting for all of you guys uh, to comment on this post so that i can further predict more coins for you guys so let's go straight to the uh coin ship usdt pair and i am predicting on polynex why because polynex exchange listed the ship coin on the 17th of april so more data we have the more valuable or more predictions we can make easily so right now what is looking we are looking at this these are the fibonacci levels you can see the fibonacci levels are wonderful uh, i have drawn them from the lower this is the lowest to the highest point all time high okay and what happened right now and this is also on the four hour chart just keep that in your mind now you see the this level has been tested and was rejected why because this candle you can see a lot of rejections here at this area so this was like a resistance this was like a support at 12 30 so it was on the cards you see uh, one rejection two rejection three rejections four rejections here okay so it means that this is a strong area this is a strong area and we see we have seen that uh, today it was rejected from this area so you can you can call this uh, this to be a main sport zone you see the sport uh, sorry this should be named as sport area so i'm gonna colorize it to yellow okay that would be good you see this one is a sport area the next sport would be at this level which is uh let me uh, mention with the help of price label so that you can guy you guys can easily easily understand and also draw here okay you see the price came down tested this level and got rejected okay what happened next it tested this swing high this one was the this candle this candle was the swing high you see it tested this previous swing high and got rejected and now we have to wait and we have to wait that if this can these upcoming candles whether they form like this and break through and make a, you know a next port next next zone will be tested which would be 879 this zone or the next candles would be breaking this level if it break this level you see this level this is the uh, let me name it as well yeah this one if new candles form and break above this level then we are in the uptrend why because you see there's a trend going on it came down came up came down then it tested this previous swing high here see and got rejected once we break above this level i'm gonna draw with the help of uh, this one would be good came up came down came came up here then came down and now it is tested and has been rejected from this area now what's next is if we break above this level because this is the previous swing high you see this one is the previous swing high if the new candle breaks above um, maybe these candles you can see the price came down again here now we need to break above this level this level this level would be very important see this one would be very important once we break this level then we are in the uptrend then we're going to test the next swing this would that would be here 78 percent and this one is very important why i'm uh, calling this one because 61 percent is the golden you know it's a golden zone of fibonacci level once you cross this level uh, usually happens we see a good zone good movement on up to the we might see all time high soon but for now these the next candle which has been which is being formed here you see also just keep that in let, let me delete this these arrows for now so uh, you guys can easily 
you see the chart now what is happening right now you see uh lower low it formed new lower low new lower low now new lower low now the next thing you see here the price went up you see here it tested bought but got rejected then price came down like this okay now what is happening right now it tested the previous swing high here and got rejected now a new swing uh, you can call higher low is formed La higher low is forming and if we see the new candles being formed like this one we might see a retest again to this level and if it breaks above this level then surely we are going to test this area and once we break this area we are in the surely in the uptrend for now but we have also need to look at the price of btc see the btc dominance is decreasing and this is the btc price here 44000 it just tested this area and uh, that's it guys that's it we just need confirmation now if we look at the volume if i turn on the volume see a good volume this is a good volume it means that this green candle has a good buying volume and after that the selling volume was very low it means not uh, there are not a lot of sellers and a very low volume now this candle the next one which is being formed is very you know very very low volume it means accumulation we might see some accumulation at this zone okay and then a retest at this level so that's the current scenario guys that's a current scenario if i turn on the yeah see you see uh, let me show this one would be this one would be a hundred ema okay this one is the hundred ema and whenever the price stays above the hundred ema it means we are in the uptrend and you see if it breaks below this hundred ema if it breaks below and then we are in the downtrend always wait for the confirmation for the new candles and then if i told you if this level this area uh, let me draw this one here yeah if this area is tested again and then broke we if we broke break above this level then we might be in the uptrend so wait for the confirmations guys with the good volume we can break above this area so that's it guys that's it for now uh, that was the price prediction that was the technical analysis of shiba anu shiba anu i don't know shiba shiba anu usdt take care Tada, bye bye